Oh, all right. So I put these in. Exit out. Cancel. All right, just cancel out of there. Oh. All right, so go back. Um, all right, so we don't. Go to your homework. Is this your homework? Yes. All right, so click here. Oh. All right. Let, let me say what I'm telling her. Uh, all right, go to your own homework problem. Okay. okay? And click here. All right. If you click here, it will export the data for you. Okay? So you want to click open in StackCrunch. Now StackCrunch will open with the data populated for you. All right? You with me so far? All right, I'll do it again. Oh, never mind. Let's do it again anyway. So I'm going to click right here. You see where I'm clicking? I'm going to hit open in stack forms. It's going to export the data for me. Right? Then I'm going to click stat. All right? So this is, uh, we're, we're looking at a population mean that, that's involved in our hypothesis test. So we're looking at our T stats. It's one sample, but this time with data. All right, and now we have to tell StackCrunch what data. So we click variable one, and when we send it from when we send it from there to there, that that we've communicated to StackCrunch that that's our data, right? Then our hypothesis steps. What are we interested in? We're interested in um, whether the craft test is less than a thousand for the head in. Uh, head injury index, all right? And what is our, our critical value? You want to click on a critical value because we want to see it. We have a significance of 0.05. Then we're going to compute <coughs> our data, all right? There's our results. Oh, you want me to back it up again? No, just, okay. <laughs> back it up? No, I mean, you're doing, it's just, wow. Oh, gotcha. Yeah. <laughs> Listen, I'm a, I'm a man of a certain age. I, I, don't, I don't speak the uh, language of young people anymore. Right? All right, so let's do it again. It'll be so much fun. <laughs> Tell all your yeah, friends. All right. Do you get it? Yeah. Yeah, how great is that, right? Yo, we got 11 days to get good at this, too. And I'll be available. I'll be available. I only teach four classes next week. All right? So you can, another college. So you can reach out to me like all the time. All right, let's do it again. Day, ready? Mm -hmm. Yeah. 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 We're, we're going to have a, a real, a real shindig, real humdinger. All right. So I'm going to click here because I want to, I want all the, I want to send this data to StackCrunch. So I'm going to send it to StackCrunch. And there's my data. So now I'm going to go to stat, and now I know we're, we have a mean involved. So we want a T stat. Then we got one sample, we have data, all right? So now I'm going to tell stat crunch, where's my data? It's in, it's in the var one column. And then I'm going to say, okay, what's my hypothesis <coughs> test? Well, my alternate, or my null hypothesis is that it's equal to 1,000. My alternate hypothesis is that it's less than 1,000. Then we want to show the critical value. We have an alpha level of 0.05. Then we're going to compute and dang, we are done, mm -hmm. right? So, and now we know how to read these rejection region things, right? Okay, so, there's my critical value. Remember what I said to you about like, the, 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 the how much data, we only had 12, is that really all we had? Oh, it's, it's even less, right? Mm -hmm. This isn't even, so we had six, right? So we have five degrees of freedom. It's going to be really, really hard to reject the null hypothesis because we don't have a lot of data. There's no power in that data, right? But look, look, look at my critical value. My critical value is way over there. I got to be on the, on the left of negative 2.02-ish, right? Rounded to, to two decimal places, right? So what's my test statistic? My test statistic isn't, isn't falling in that rejection region. What, what if the test st statistic thing confuses me? All right? Look at my p-value. 
What's my alpha level? My alpha level is 0.05. Is my p-value less than 0.05? No. Then we do not reject. I reject. I reject. <laughs> you know. Well, my T-stats. She's got a different question. Oh, gotcha. Um, yeah, so you're going to have different data, right? Yeah. But um, it's hard to reject the null hypothesis when you have such a small data set. It's got to be really compelling, right? That's the, the smaller that, that number of samples, the more this T statistic moves, like if it's left tail, the, 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 the further and further away that critical T gets from the mean. Right? We don't have a lot of data. It's got to be really compelling. It's got to be like off by a lot. For six data you know, points to, to reject the null, it's got to be off by a lot. That's when we have small amounts of data. That sends that N, you know, that sends that, that critical T further and further and further away from